Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a chit chat type of tutorial. I just kind of want to chat with you guys. I have a bunch of stuff to tell you and I, there's just stuff I want to say. There's things I want to ask you. My throat is so sore right now. I think I might be getting sick. So if my voice starts cracking, that would be why. But today I just wanted, oh my god, I'm gonna die. <coughs> I don't understand. Um, today I'm going to be Showing you guys my everyday makeup routine that I've been doing for school. It I wouldn't necessarily say it's like a full face of makeup, but it's more makeup than most people probably wear. But like, it takes me like 10, 12 minutes to do it. So I'm fine with putting on a bunch of makeup because it literally takes no time at all and I just look better. So that's what I'm going to be showing you guys today. I'm going to talk through it. I'm going to try and play some music. Spotify is not working on my computer for some reason, so we're going to try and do it through the app. So, I'm going to go ahead and talk a little bit about what I'm going to be doing for my base. It is so hard to talk right now. My throat really hurts. Wow. So, I'm going to start off by priming my face. This is the Maybelline Master Prime Primer. This is the Blur and Illuminate, and it has SPF 30 in it. So, I'm going to apply this. And then the foundation I'm going to be using is the Maybelline Fit Me Dewy Plus Smooth. I am in the color 330 Toffee. And I'm going to use the Real Techniques Blending Sponge to put this on. And then I'm going to highlight underneath my eyes with the Instant Age Rewind, Eraser, Dark Circles, and Media. So the first thing I kind of wanted to talk about is the fact that we are so close to 30,000 subscribers. We're under 70 away now. Um, I'm actually filming this the day that it's going up. I never do that just because um, I feel like it's always a hot mess because I have to edit it and then export it and then upload it and then do the description and like thumbnail and everything. But this is just kind of like a chatty get ready with me and this is going to take me like 20 minutes to edit. The next thing that I wanted to talk about as I apply my foundation to my face like this because it's almost empty is I'm going to Jamaica on the 21st and I'm going to be there for a week. I don't know if I've actually told you guys that yet. If you follow me on Instagram, then you know that I am going somewhere just because I posted, like, a picture of me posing, <laughs> um, like, in my bathing suit. Because I'm going to do, like, a little before and after. I'm just doing some, like, last minute toning, um, of all the body parts. But, yeah, I'm going to, um, Jamaica for my great-grandmother's birthday. She is turning one. Well, she already turned 100 which is awesome and she lives there and my other grandmother lives there as well so I think we're gonna be staying in a resort while I'm there I am going to try and vlog I'll probably vlog on my DSLR um, a lot of you ask I just have the Canon Rebel T3i with the basic kit lens um, also if you did not know I am a film major so I'm kind of finding new ways to get my lens to look very, like a very expensive lens because I just don't want to spend money. So like if you guys saw my morning routine, um, well half of that was filmed with a camera for school because I had to use it, but the rest was just filmed with my camera and I think it did a pretty good job. You guys are loving that video so I'm so glad because I love filming videos like that and I love doing weird angles and like messing with the focus. Now I'm gonna do my eyebrows and I'm gonna do this off camera because if I chit chat through this I'm gonna be here for like 20 minutes doing my eyebrows. If you guys want a routine or anything let me know. They've changed up a little bit. I start off with my Wet n Wild um, Sima Brown Now Eyeliner. Then I use my Bodyography Eyebrow Trio and I take the darkest shade with the Bodyography little eyebrow thing. And I fill in the outside and then on the inner part I use the lighter brown and I fill that in and then I just blend it back with my finger. So now I'm going to use the Shella Eyebrow Defining Gel and this is transparent. It looks brown now just because I've been using them when my eyebrows are filled in. But I just kind of move the hairs up in the front and then just go down. So now I'm just going to curl my eyelashes and there's really nothing to the eyes at all. Like... I don't do anything but it actually looks pretty good so I'm gonna be using my finger I'm not priming my eyes or anything 
I'm using the Maybelline Master Highlighting Bronzer. This is in Deep Bronze. And I'm going to be mixing just a cream shade with the gold one, goldy bronze one. So they don't have to be right next to each other, but I'm just mixing those together using my finger. Like I said, I like to get a little more of the bronze on my finger. And then I just go ahead and I just place it on my eyelid. And I bring it up into the crease a little bit. So now from the same compacts, I'm going to be taking that light shade that I mixed with that bronze and I'm just going to place just that one shade in my inner corner and it's just a light goldish yellow shade. I just like to have something in the inner corner because I feel like it makes my eyes look more open. For mascara I'm going to be using two. I'm going to use the e.l.f. Mineral Infused one which I think works well with any mascara that is super volumizing because it just spreads out your lashes and gets them kind of ready. Sorry I feel like this is kind of loud. And then I'm using my favorite mascara which I told you guys I was going to talk about um, sometime soon. It is the Doce, I think that's how they pronounce the brand. We got this in our BoxyCharm. Punk Volumizer, I can't say that word, Punk Volumizer Mascara. And the wand is crazy. I really want to add some more fitness to my channel. I've asked a couple of you if you'd like to see that and you said yes, but I just want to ask again, do you guys want to see some more fitness videos? I do plan on doing a full day of eating. Um, I think I may film that tomorrow, but I'm not quite sure. Kind of running out of food here, but I want to put it up like while I'm on vacation, hopefully. So I do need to film it before I go because I leave next week. Because like I said, today is the day that you're seeing this. Like that's when I'm filming it. Filming it on Wednesday. So yeah, please let me know if you guys want to see some more fitnessy videos. I get questions all the time. On like what workouts I do and guys I really wish I could film my workouts but I work out in my university's gym which is just not a gym right now because they're redoing it so we're all just packed into what was a basketball gym but maybe over winter break if I go home for a bit I am in an apartment so I have it for an annual lease um, so I have it for the entire year but I know I'm going to be going home for a while because I have like a month and a half off school because Maryland is just crazy. So maybe if I go to the YMCA, I'll get my brother to film me doing his workouts. So now I'm going to bronze up the skin and stuff because I'm just looking a little pale. So I'm going to be using my NYC bronzer in Sunny. I've not used this in a video in forever, but I've actually been using this nonstop. And I'm using my Vasanti. I'm pretty sure it's just come off blush brush and then for blush I'm going to be using the Milani Bellissimo bronze which is just the most gorgeous not orange but it's just literally just a perfect bronze shade and I am just obsessed with it if you have lighter skin definitely use a lighter hand because it is really intense and it does have shimmer in it just keep that in mind and then I'm going to be highlighting with the um, master highlight bronzer that I use my eyes. I'm going to be mixing that gold and champagne shade that I used on my eyes for highlight and I'm also going to be... <clears throat> See what I said about my voice cracking? I'm also going to be using blush gems by e.l.f. I just don't sound like a real person right now. By the way guys, I got a really cool watch for my birthday. It is the Polar Watch, so it's like a fitness watch. It counts my steps. Um, when I work out, it counts my calories. And if I wear my heart rate monitor, which I always try and do, um, I've only used it like four times so far because I haven't had that long. But um, it keeps track of your heart rate. And it's so funny because I was on the treadmill like doing some HIIT cardio. And the treadmill told me I burned like 80 calories and the watch told me I burned like 120 so all those times I was on the treadmill and I was like oh I just want to burn like 15 more calories and then I'll get off but in reality I had burned like 50 more than that already it's just how can you be so inaccurate but yeah, I'm loving this. It's the Polar Watch. This is the A300, and I just have the white band on it. It's really cool because you can actually take the watch out of the band and plug it into your computer. 
and it'll put all of your information online so you can see it and you can break it down so it tells you your calories it tells you like your heart rate um, it tells you your activity for the day how many steps you took it's just really cool and I believe my mom said it was like 160 it was my birthday present it was the only thing I asked for because I really didn't want anything so just in case you guys were wondering that's why my mom bought it so now like I said before I'm going to be mixing that champagne and that gold for my highlight I've been liking gold more on my skin tone it looks a lot less ashy but this is not really the best choice um so I do still mix it with the blush gems highlighter which is more of a pink from elf please let me know of good gold highlighters that aren't that expensive because like champagne pop it's like forty dollars I just can't bring myself to spend that much money on a highlighter so if you guys know any of cheaper gold highlighters that would like work with my skin tone and wouldn't look too ashy please let me know because I'm really looking for one um, now I'm going to be using blush gems and just placing that right over top. <clears throat> and this is just kind of making it more intense because we all know I like my highlighters super intense. And then a secret of how I kind of like blend my highlight and blush and bronzer all together is I actually pick up some more blush and I blend it onto the highlight a bit. And it just kind of makes it less of a line on my face and more blended. And then if I need to, I'll just pop a little more highlight down my cheekbones. And then I take my Real Techniques big powder brush and I actually tap on my face because I find it just knocks off that extra, especially with this e.l.f. highlighter because it's kind of more chunky. Um, and then I just blend actually around the forehead area. My last step is lipstick. So the lipstick that I use is the Maybelline lipstick in cinnamon and this is in their um nudes line this isn't matte it's just their creamy ones and then for gloss i use the maybelline color elixir in glistening amber which is kind of a i don't want to say bronzy it's kind of like an orangish gloss So I think it goes really well with my skin tone. This is one of those colors where this goes good with everyone's skin tone. So now I'm all ready for the day. In case you guys are wondering, um, you guys will actually see this in the haul coming up on Friday, I'm pretty sure is when I'm putting it up. This sweater is from either Shein or Romwe, I don't remember. My necklace is from Happiness Boutique, and my beanie is just from Target. I know some people were going to ask, so there you are, because a lot of people were commenting on my necklace in my last video, so I thought I would just tell you guys. But... This is it for today's look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, this is just what I do every day for school. Obviously, you don't have to put on all this makeup. This is just what I like to do just to look put together. If I want to look put together, if I don't care. Like I said at the beginning, I literally just do brows and mascara. So it's honestly just preference. If you guys enjoyed this, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And also subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already. Get excited for that haul coming Friday. Leave me some comments down below. Let me know if you guys want to see fitness. If you guys do want me to vlog while I'm in Jamaica, definitely let me know um, so I can post those while I'm there. And yeah, anything else that I said in the video that I wanted you to comment on, leave that in the comments down below. And I'll see you all in my next one. I love you. Bye.